Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspie's Hobbyland here doing a random first name letter break of, you guessed it, 2016 Futera Unique World Football or Soccer. This is break number 24 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. The next one's already in the store. Check it out. This one sold out pretty quickly, so I don't think it's going to... The next one should probably sell out super quick as well. There's everybody who got into this break. Appreciate it. There's all the first name letters. Let's roll the dice. Randomize each list four times. Three and a one. One, two, three... And four. There you go. David with the top spot and the bottom spot. He's a top and a bottom, folks. Hey oh. Three and a one, four times for the letters. One, two, three, and four. G on top. M in the bottom spot. And here's how it all shakes out. So G goes to David. K for Victoria, U, V, Y, and X for Mike. L for John Parr. I can think of a couple L's. E for Mark. D for Victoria. John, you have R, T, Z, and J. I and O for Nicholas. N and W for Matt. Uh, David Waltz, you have uh, F. Regimel with S. B for Rick T. H for Todd. A for John. You also have C. P for Scott. And M for David Waltz in the last spot mojo. There you go, folks. That was the randomizing portion of the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Usually there isn't. And then we'll uh, come back and have the one box break. Stick around. All right, welcome back, folks. There were no trades in this break. So this list right here remains the same in break 24. Remember, 20, break 25 already in the store. So let's get that going. And this was the last, the last inner right there. A last box in that inner case. So the next one box break we do will be from a fresh case. We also have personal boxes available on jazbeeshobbyland.com, and that comes from another different inner case. So we kind of we keep those a little bit separated. So Tommy Bowers is has some what so, some soccer news for me? Did I hear about Burger King and Zenit? Is that at St. Petersburg? What happened? All right, first box. I can imagine some like lost in translation thing happening there between Burger King and Wow. Burger King offered Zenit like six million, six million what <laughs> rubles to change their name to Zenit Burger King. Wow, that's kind of a big club though out in Russia. It would take a lot more than six million of anything. Euros or pounds or dollars. Jerome Boateng leads us off. We've got that card was kind of stuck right there. Dali Blind. And the hit is a triple relic. What do we got here? Memo Stars, triple relic. Is that Joe Hart? It is. Five out of 17. England keeper, Joe Hart. Man City keeper, Joe. Well, look that up. He's having some issues there, but that's pretty nice. That's from the Manchester City versus Chelsea match. Those are, or oh, that's from Manchester Chelsea. That's from the Euro Championships. And the, that's part of his goalkeeper gloves. That's pretty awesome. Five out of 17. And as you know, I'm covering up those serial numbers right there for the Futera game. That's on their website. Nice one. Joe Hart, letter J, going out to John Parker. Wow. So, so for technically 5.7 million pounds, Burger King offered Zenit St. Petersburg, changed their name to Zenit Burger King. I'm assuming they decline. Well, it's not like it's like like what is that Red Bull team uh, in 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 Switzerland? Well, there's one in New York too. New York Red Bulls and like Slossberg or something like that. Maybe South Germany, but it's not like it's like Red Bulls. Kind of sounds cool, you know? Like you could you could you could couldn't blame a team for going with that. But Zenit Burger King, not sure if it has the same uh, ring to it. 
Another J for John, Johan Cruyff. 87 out of 99 for the orange. There's a piece of the match day jersey in there too, or match day program in there. That's pretty nice. Was it from the 79-80 season when he played for the Los Angeles Aztecs back in the day? Here comes the autograph. Wow, nice. Liverpool boss, Jurgen Klopp. Memorable autograph. Nice auto, Jurgen. 7 out of 35 on that one. Also features a piece of the match day program from uh, the Spurs-Liverpool match. 17th October 2015, which I believe was his first match as manager after uh, Brendan Rodgers was sacked. There it is. Nice Jurgen Klopp. Another J for John Parker. The Jays are cleaning up on this. Wow. Remember, folks, even the uh, even the base cards when collected together, you know, when sold, could get you the cost of admission back. So this is this is pretty worth it, in my opinion. There's Peter Schmeichel, heritage card. These are numbered. These are the only insert sets that's actually numbered on the back like this, serial numbered. 24 out of 50. Peter Schmeichel, great keeper. Letter P goes out to Scott Z. There you go, Scott. There's Mesut Ozil. There's Zlatan, Wayne Rooney, Thiago Silva. The game used memorabilia. I've heard of this guy. That's CR7, Cristiano Ronaldo. Where's that orange jersey come from? That must be his Portugal. Oh, I guess it's a, it must be their third kit or their away kit, I guess. There you go. That's where it's from. And the match, a piece of the match day program from a match out in 2013. 24 out of 99 on that. Cristiano Ronaldo. Letter C, John Parker. Guys, he's been crushing, crushing on this. He did buy like five spots, so that, that probably helps too. All right, next. We do have another one box break in the store and personal boxes available of this. Jaspieshobbyland.com. Be greedy. Get a personal box. It's all right. Angel Correa. And Sergio Guero. Nice. That's 3 out of 11 on the Sergio Guero. Nice, nice, nice. For the letter S, going out to Regimel. I think he elbowed someone in like week 1 or week 2 or something like that. I think he's about to be suspended for like a little bit. There's Gianfranco Zola. And we've got training use memorabilia, Frank Lampard. Nice. That is 26 out of 99. That comes from a Man City training war. Oh, yeah. He was in Man City for a second. Man City training war jersey from the 14-15 season. And a piece of the match day program as well. Uh, playing for NYFC now, I believe, in the MLS. Frank Lampard, letter F, going to David Waltz. And there you go, folks. That's it. That was random letter break number 25. As you guys can tell, big fan of the soccer. Uh, would enjoy doing a lot more of these. So go to jazpiecehobbyland.com and get things going, folks. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next time.